Hello, this is Lee Anthony Davis here on my YouTube channel announcement video. Uh, today is Sunday the 17th of September and today I'm doing it rather early than usual. So uh, that's a plus, isn't it? Right. So anyway, the announcements as usual, group of the day, contribute of the day, uh, birthday announcements, a tiny bit of Doctor Who news, updates and uh, the Doctor Who quiz question from yesterday and, uh, and one for today and of course uh, my Doctor Who uh, memorabilia at the end of it and also uh, coming up right okay then let's get on with it uh, firstly uh, these people well not these people well this person uh, uh, I'll, re I'll rephrase that this group <laughs> Oh, it's that time of night. Right, okay. Uh, it's, I'll start off with group of the day. <laughs> right, group of the day goes to, uh, on Saturday the 17th, uh, sorry, Saturday the 16th of September, the Awesome Cybermen group on Facebook. Group of the day is the Awesome Cybermen group. And contributor of the day goes to Ruth Beckett. So congratulations to one and all for being uh, nominated by me. Uh, doesn't mean anything really, it's just a little bit of fun. Uh, so anyway, moving on to birthdays. Uh, today celebrating a birthday on Sunday the 17th of uh, September. Uh, we've got Oliver Jackson, David Ho, Pat O'Neill, uh, Robika Vo, Henrik Silva, Matthew Hawkins are all celebrating their birthdays today. Well done. Right, a little bit of Dot 2 news, just a little bit. Uh, not much, probably knew it already. Uh, BAFTA Award winner Lenny Rush, who's only 14 years of age, will be joining the new series, uh, which will feature the new Dr. Gatwa, uh, Nishuti Gatwa and Millie, uh, whatever, Gibson, that's it. Uh, she'll be uh, he'll be appearing as a character called Morris so I presume he'll be in and out the series right so that's that's basically all I'm going to tell you about that it's not really much news uh, but I can also tell you if you enjoy Doctor Who uh, the the new the new era uh, you can watch all the four episodes on uh, from series one to series 13 on BBC iPlayer or Netflix, uh, the full episodes, obviously. Uh, so, you know, if you if you, you can't wait for Doctor Who, that's where to go. Netflix or BBC iPlayer. You got all the full. I've actually been there myself, so I know, and uh, it's still there as far as I know. Before, uh, I don't know Walt Disney put a block on it or whatever. I don't know. So anyway, there you go. Uh, that's all I have to tell you on the Doctor Who news. Not much, was it? Right, I just crammed it in actually. Uh, moving on, uh, updates. Uh, this is to do with my page, a group, and my account on Instagram. Right, my page is now uh, the Lee Anthony Davis, the dot two page, is now gone up to 45 followers. That's brilliant. And my Lee Anthony Davis, the Doctor Who group, is now reached 55 members. Fantastic. Thank you for joining. I appreciate it very much. Uh, on my Instagram account, I've now reached nearly 80. I'm on 79 followers on there, so thank you very much. So hopefully I'll be able to tell you I've reached my 80th tomorrow. Right, moving on to the quiz, uh, the Dot 2 quiz question that I posed yesterday. Uh, which actor played a vampire, which Doctor Who actor played a vampire in uh, a horror film? And I wanted to know which was the uh, Doctor Who actor and the film he appeared in. The answer is, obviously, John Pertwee. Uh, he appeared in The House That Dripped Blood, uh, 1970 or 71. Now, just before he became Doctor Who, so it was definitely 1970 or 69. Could have been one of that, but it was certainly before he was Doctor Who. So probably that was his last role before he was uh, ready to film uh, his his uh, tenure in the series. So anyway, and what's uh, fundamental about that film is that there were some actors also appearing in that that appeared in John Pertwee's era as well. I'm thinking of John Bennett, uh, who went on to play... Uh, 
uh, let's see, he was in uh, Invasion of the Dinosaurs. He was also in uh, the towns of Wen Chiang. And also uh, the lovely Ingrid Pitt, or shall I say the late Ingrid Pitt from the Hammer Horror Days. Uh, she appeared in Doctor Who twice. Uh, she appeared with John Pertwee in that vampire story uh, that he played a vampire. And uh, ironically, she would appear with him in The Time Monster. And uh, also, but she didn't appear with him in the in the next one because she it was Peter Davidson in Warriors of the Deep. But anyway, so there you have it. There was a few. There was a I think there was a few more. I can't remember. I don't because it was because uh, it was like uh, five segments. You know, like uh, five stories into a film. A bit like Thought of Horror. Uh, many many films they made. Uh, uh, Tales from the Crypt. Uh, basically, uh, John Pertwee was in it along with Christopher Lee, uh, Ingrid Pitt, I've just mentioned, John Bennett. Uh, also, Denham Elliott, Peter Cushing, not forgetting him. And uh, let's see, I'm just trying to remember the fifth one, uh, the first one. I think, I can't remember, I can't. Joss Ackland was in it as well, Joss Ackland and... Uh, I've got the film. I haven't watched it for quite some time, so I can't really give you the details on the actors in it. But I know three of them appeared with John Pertwee uh, from that film onto Doctor Who. Right, OK, that's enough of that. So anyway, uh, that's the answer. John Pertwee, The House of Drip Blood. Right, now I've got another question for you. Uh, David Troughton, who is famous, is one of the famous sons of Patrick, who played Doctor Who, obviously, uh, appeared in Doctor Who himself. Uh, what I want to know is, how many adventures did he appear in? That's all. How many adventures did David Troughton appear in Doctor Who? Right. Uh, now it's time for my Doctor Who memorabilia. I'm just going to show you this quick, because uh, time is at an essence. Uh, this one's my David Tennant and Billy Piper. This is the uh, first season of David Tennant when he when he joined Doctor Who. Uh, this is when they did the Teddy Boy, uh, the 1950s. This was the uh, Idiot's Lantern. This is the front cover for it. There you go. Uh, I've got uh, one from uh, the old the classics, as you go. Uh, Patrick Troughton there, who I mentioned earlier, and William Hartnell. Uh, here, here we've got, uh, just moving them over there a bit, uh, here we've got uh, Verity Lambert uh, with uh, the cast of some of the monsters from the Dalek Master Plan, or the Mission to the Unknown, sorry, Mission to the Unknown, there you go. This is how Verity used to look like. <laughs> Uh, we've got David Tennant and Elizabeth Sladen. This is when Elizabeth Sladen appeared. Uh, David Tennant was a guest star on Elizabeth's show in the Sarah Jane Adventures. As you can see, she's in, uh, I think it was the wedding of Sarah Jane. Uh, and David Tennant was a guest star there. Uh, as then, he was the doctor then. There you go. Uh, we've got one from uh, uh, Sylvester McCoy in the Chronicle Doctor Who's. Uh, there you go. Front cover of that. Just showing you that. I've got one for Daleks only. There you are. You might, I thought you might like that one. Dalek one, Doctor Who magazine. Right, here's the current Doctor Who uh, team. Uh, Mishuti Gatwa and Millie Gibson. There you go. That's a Doctor Who. Uh, here, uh, I can't get it all out, but what these, these are all bits and bobs of Doctor Who that I've collected over the past. I'll just show you quickly before I go. Uh, they're basically pamphlets and stuff to do with Doctor Who, there you go, I'll show you it quickly, so you can see that, right, and I've got a TARDIS here, but I'm not going to get that out, it's going to take too long to, to get all this stuff out, as you can see I'm having trouble putting that back in now, uh, here is one with uh, Jodie Whittaker, who was then the Doctor, uh, in the magazine, there you go, uh, David Tennant, uh, this is the new one out, by the way, there you go, I've got the new magazine out, it came out uh, three weeks ago, I've just got it the next one's due out in uh, two weeks uh i think it's due out next week the uh, new one so it'll be out on monday and finally just to finish off got through this torturous uh, moment uh this is a doctor who book i'll just give you a quick uh, glimpse of what's inside it it's facts and figures uh, there you go 
facts and figures on uh, can you see it I'll oh, do it that way there you go facts and figures on Doctor Who there's Sarah Jane there with uh, I can't really show you like that because it's it's impossible uh, showing a book is not easy uh, especially the inside and the camera angle as well but as you can see I'll, I'll just give you a quick uh, glimpse can I can I can I get that in it's just a camera angle there you go I'm just going through flicking it through the family of blood there you go family of blood <laughs> so anyway that's it and a quick shot uh, close up with the Dalek and the Cybermen well, okay that's it that's all I have to uh, show you on uh, this uh, video announcement uh, that's my dot two memorabilia I've got some more I can assure you but I'm sure you're looking forward to that right okay then thank you very much for watching that's it uh, coming up I've got uh, another lost in time uh, lost in space uh, video going up uh, I call them the cliffhangers all right so they're not trailers they're cliffhangers so join me for that anyway thanks for watching I'll see you at this, hopefully at the same time tomorrow uh, look after yourselves and have a nice evening or nice sleep as you are sleeping right now. <laughs> I'm just waffling on. Uh, so, good night, look after yourselves, and I'll see you same time tomorrow. Bye for now.